Hello everyone, welcome to the engineering training channel. In this video, I will show you how to model two-phase flow with Fluent. In this example, we want to model air water flow in a channel. The first step is creating the domain of the model. In this section, we create a two-dimensional channel and then change it to a surface. The second step is meshing the domain. We should refine the mesh near the wall because we have regions with higher gradients of variables. For this purpose, we use the bias option. We define inlet and outlet regions for boundary conditions. The third step is defining physics and boundary conditions in fluent. We need to define water as a liquid in the Fluent database. The flow is laminar. In this example, we use the VOF method to model the two flows of water and air. Here, we need to define phase 1 and phase 2 and also define the interaction between phases due to surface tension. In this section, we need to define the inlet boundary condition for the inlet. The inlet velocity is 0.1 meters per second, and the volume fractions of water and air are 0.5 each. Here, we need to define initial conditions for the model. Also, we can create a contour to see the volume fraction of water.
Finally, we go to the calculation section and define the time step and number of time steps. According to the results, it is clear that the water goes to the bottom of the channel because its density is significantly higher than air. Also, there are some wavy regions due to the interaction between water and air caused by surface tension forces. Do not forget to subscribe our channel and like video.